How about bringing back to the stage our guest artist? She is one of the most amazing people, and we've we uh, had spent a few days with her. She's an amazing human being, great. She's probably at the top in our top two of all guest artists. So how about a round of applause and once again for the great Tanya Darby. <laughs> Tanya Darby. And um, if I can embarrass her for a moment, I actually met her when she was in high school. And a couple years ago, <laughs> when I played with Roy Hargrove, and I just to say I played with Roy Hargrove in, uh, a few years back. Mm -hmm. And she was just a young, young, nice young lady, playing some great trumpet then, back then as well. Uh, let's let the lady speak. Thank you, Prof. Prof Whitaker. Um, we don't always get to thank the people that are standing in front of the bands for all their hard work, all their dedication, and they're very, as far as dedication goes, there are very few people that I can think of that work as hard and that are as dedicated to these young men and women that you see on stage as Professor Whitaker. So Professor Whitaker, thank you for what you do. Thank you for what you do. Yeah. And as far, as far as you see what on stage, as far as these young men and women on stage, we see the, the product, right? So you come to the concert, you know, there's a lot of parents out here, and you know, you, you come to the concert to see your kids play, and this is the culmination of all this work, but we forget that behind all of this greatness that you hear are great mentors and great professors. And here at um, Michigan State University, you know, you have one of the most amazing faculties here to work with. So if there are faculty members in the audience, can I get you to st probably stand if there are any in the audience? So we can give you a huge round of applause and thank you for what you do. All right, all right. And underneath this product, we forget that these people are in school too. Right, they're studying, they're cramming, they're trying to pass courses, they're doing graduate work, they're doing theses, you know. I was just talking to somebody today that had run back and forth across, there's like, I guess 50, it's like a 15 minute walk back and forth around campus like five times today just to make sure that they were going to their classes, making rehearsals and sound checks. So there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes between what you see here, the stage hands, the sound people back there. So please, um, on your way out. I was I almost said tip your bartenders, wow. Wow, can you tell I'm seasoned? <laughs> it's been a long week already, but really, thank you all for an amazing experience, and I'm looking forward to the rest of the week. You know, I was, um, I had a gig in New York about three weeks ago, and I was driving back, you know, through the mountains, you know, looking at a nice, beautiful fall day, and on XM radio, you know, Christian McBride, Big Band came on and they were swinging, boy. I was like, wow. We have two faculty members that are in the band, uh, Michael Dees, who was directing the last band, and of course, Xavier, Xavier Davis, and they were just swinging. I said, you know, we had Christian at the school. I think we got this chart. So we're gonna play his tune called Shade of the, Shade of the Cedar Tree that he wrote in dedication to Cedar Walton.
Thank you. 
Tanya Darby. Tanya Darby, MSU Jazz Orchestra One. Thank you, thank you. How about a round of applause for all the bands? Michael Dees, our two TAs conducting the band. Great job tonight. Thank you all.